Got a bit of a quick video today, but it's going to be an important one. Um, so I was having a lot of trouble getting these stasis melee final blows with the behemoth titan for the umbral infiltration quest. It's one of the quests to get um, shards for your abilities that you turn into the exo stranger on Europa. But anyway, so here you can see me doing it properly. I was using the regular melee with a stasis class. That was not working. Let's just punch stuff, I said, but that was not working. So I said, okay, we'll charge up the melee and uh, wait till it's charged every time, hit one single target with it carefully, and that'll count towards it. Still was not counting towards the kills. So I'm like, all right, what do we do now? Um, I tried a couple of things, and what I noticed was the enemy has to be frozen. So here, in this video, you can see me actually using, I'll throw the grenade, I'll freeze an enemy, and then with a fully charged melee, I'll hit them. That is the only way I was able to complete this quest, this umbral infiltration. Here's the grenade, he's frozen, now the charged melee. That was it. The second part, um, the other part is going to be your super final blows. Easy one here, I would say switch over to another class where you have a super that can be extended with kills. Um, Striker Titan worked for me here, Fist of Havoc with, um, is it Relentless, I believe? Uh, trample, okay. So every time you get a kill, it'll keep the super going. That'll make it easier to get the kills and to finish the quest. Anytime you're doing kills, any kind of kills, <laughs> you're gonna go to the moon, you're gonna go to the Scarlet Keep Strike, and you can exit out, or glitch back out into the main part of the map to do the Altars of Sorrow, which is what we're doing here in the video. Um, luckily, I actually join on people who are already doing it. These guys were already just doing the farm and getting their kills, getting their strike kills for whatever reason. Um, so here I'm just pretty much just charging it up. Charging my super. Gonna pop your super, gonna get those kills. It's a lot easier than messing around with the, the stasis, you know, freeze and smash titan ability. Um, with the other classes, it might be a little easier, maybe with the Warlock shooting the, the stasis balls at people or whatever, but for the Titan, I think this was a lot easier just to switch over, use Fist of Havoc, and get those super kills. Um, the other part of the quest I completed naturally, I didn't even notice I completed it, just by using a stasis class in your weekly strikes. So, use stasis as much as you can when you're doing these, you'll get a lot of stuff done. But, like me, you might be struggling with that first part with the melee. Um, I explained how to do that in this video, which we showed, you know, you freeze, then you use a charge melee. And all you should have left is these super kills if you don't have them done already. Um, and that's pretty much it. So you'll see here, I think I'm just filling the bar. A ton of enemies here. Um, you can also do your exotic catalyst here too if you want to, you know, get a thousand kills with your risk runner or uh, with any of the other ones that require just massive amounts of kills. So here we are getting the super kills. Every time I kill someone, it extends it because of trample. I think I blow up here at the end. <laughs> I'm one of those guys <laughs> just decides to punch a exploder. Yep, okay, so there, yeah, I blew up. But anyway, I was able to get a good solid, I think, 10 super kills there. And here I am finishing it. You'll see the item pop up on screen once the quest is done. There you go. So what is it? Yeah, it's a memory fragment. So you finish Umbral Infiltration, you get the memory fragment, and you're ready to go turn that into the Exo uh, Stranger on Europa. That's pretty much it. Um, hopefully this helps somebody that was having issues with the melee like me, but that's it.